We're back today talking about the 6.0 Power Stroke Ford engine here, and today's focus is going to be on the ICP or the injection control pressure sensor. And some of the more common problems that we're going to see faced with this. One of the most common problems most technicians have faced and have seen over the years is the ICP itself leaking through the pigtail connector. And as you can see here, this pigtail has seen its fair share of miles. It actually has some oil moisture around it, just pulling it off on the bench here. So that's going to be a pretty good example of something that you can see happening with this ICP. So it's always recommended to replace the pigtail at the same time as the sensor. Now you can get these both uh, sensor separate, both pigtail separate, or you can get them as a kit. I always recommend doing it as a kit simply because of those known issues with the pigtail itself. What you don't want is to put a new ICP in and have any type of wear or corrosion built up on the pigtail itself or oil or moisture inside those terminals because what that's going to do is it could cause problems on the new ICP or it could show a false negative as a problem with the ICP after the repair is done, causing the technician to have to go back through and do another diagnostic, possibly change the ICP a second time, and then it might be the second or third time before they finally decide they're going to do a pigtail, and that resolves the issue. So again, our recommendation is always going to be replace the new ICP with a new pigtail at the same time. And you'll notice the pigtails are going to come with butt connectors already on them, it's very simple. You're just going to splice into the original wiring harness, clamp those down. Uh, there's a spot for it there. And then you've got not only a new ICP, but a new connector as well to make sure that you have good connection. You have a good new ICP in there. And then you're not going to have any false negatives or issues whenever it comes to a diagnosis on this particular repair. Uh, another thing to mention is these ICPs are pretty sensitive. Uh, so what we want to make sure we do is Always do an oil change anytime you're doing anything that has to do with uh, oil pressure, fuel pressure, any type of pressure related components that go on these 6 power strokes. It's just always good to go ahead and get an oil change done, uh, fuel filters, oil filters, those kind of things to make sure that this sensor itself can do its job as thoroughly and as effectively as possible. And hopefully now you have a better understanding of the importance of replacing both the ICP and the pigtail at the same time. Thank you.